Here I continue with the video games show. So I have quite a bit of video games. I just want to show you today how many I have. Just a good selection. You can see some good games and bad games that I have. Okay, I'm gonna start with the Star Wars The Force Unleashed 2 game. <clears throat> it's in here. Disc. This. This game right here. It's okay for all you guys that are very, very good, but if you just want to have fun and use the cheats, it's not really great because the cheats are not good in this game. So if you if you just want to use the cheats, stick to the Star Wars one Force Unleashed on the PSP version. It's it's much better. Another game that I have is um Red Dead Redemption. This game's okay, but for some reason it glitches out with the cheats. It's like when I use the cheats, I always have to turn them on again every time I go there. And when the cheats are on, it doesn't save my dad in the storyline, so that sucks. Never really liked that. So, it's okay if you want to do like online multiplayer to go around. Okay. Also, another great game that I have, it's already old now, is um. UFC 2010. This game's very fun for fighting and stuff. If you like fighting, you can get it. I also have the game MMA. This is probably a better version of the game, but it has less storyline. The storyline mode is not good in this one, but the fighting is better and the people are better too, so. Here's NHL 11. NHL 12 already came out, and I'm going to show you that game later, but this game is very fun. It's actually a very, very fun game to get, like, when you do fantasy draft. It's very fun if you like hockey, so. Here is the Star Wars game. It's okay. Once you beat it, it's already it's fine. You want to do multiplayer in it. But it's, a, it's pretty good to have. <clears throat> Sorry, there. It's pretty good to have when if you want a game just to fool around with to unlock all the characters or whatever. Well this game is very fun, but the story mode is extremely difficult. Call of Duty World of War. Zombies is amazing. But Black Ops is probably better now, so might as well get Black Ops. And here's a game you guys might not know about too much. It's called Rainbow Vegas 2. This game is very fun in story mode because you could unlock different costumes like a block of lava put on your face. You could pimp out your guys, pimp out your guns, put all the camo and stuff. It's, it's very fun. So, yeah. Here's Rock Band 2. That's, that's probably the best Rock Band so far. So, you guys want to get that. But the drums, it costs a lot. So, if, if you have enough, why don't you could get the drums in the set. Here is Call of Duty Black Ops. This game is awesome. It it's a, it gets a little boring right now, but when you just want to have fun, just play this game. It's very fun. You must have this game. South Africa, personally, is a hard game, but I heard it's fun. Me, personally, I'm not that much of a soccer game fan, but for, I bet you some of you guys will like it. So if you want to get it, it's okay. It's not that bad. Here's the Beatles Rock Band game. It came with Rock Band 2 when I got the whole set. Yeah, it's, it's not that great. Call of Duty 4, I personally don't like it, but if you get bored of all the other card games, you could just play this. Here's NBA 2K11. That's actually pretty fun, like where you get all the legends and all the celebrities. That's pretty cool, too. And here's the last game, NCCA Basketball. I personally like this better than the Pro version because it's easier to shoot and stuff. And it's cool to play with college teams instead of pro teams. Thank you for listening to my video. And when I get some more new games later, I'll give you an update. And wait one second. I actually have some more games. Go fast.
Here's the new NHL 12. Oh, sorry. Here's the new NHL 12. It's very, very fun game. It's cool. You can play with Wayne Gretzky and all the cool legends. Very cool. The discs in the right here. Disc. And it comes with a thing going to the internet, so it's cool. And also a very fun game. Grand Theft Auto. I love this game. You can just do anything you want, pit by your cars and if you really want to have fun in this game, you need to get the cheats. Probably takes around 20 minutes, but it's worth it in the end. Okay, thank you. Bye.